hello everyone in this video let's see how can we interact with aws s3 buckets using tailend let us create delete validate and list buckets in aws this is my aws management console let's navigate to s3 bucket i have one bucket called jim mccalley now let's create a bucket using tailend create job Let's name it as AWS S3 Bucket. Purpose is to interact with AWS S3 Bucket using Tailend. Description Description let's say AWS S3 bucket and tail end integration. We have to use TS3 bucket create component to create a new bucket in AWS. These are the properties of the component. Let me define access key and secret key. We get these keys when AWS account is created. Let's create a bucket ETL AWS. We can select the region if required. I'm selecting default region. Let's run the job. job is completed let me refresh AWS management console bucket named ETL AWS is created Let's create one more bucket. Let me name it as Tailend DI. Let's run the job again. job is completed let me refresh again yes new bucket talent di is created Now let's delete a bucket. 
we have to use ts3 bucket delete component let me define the credentials let's delete tail and di bucket running the job completed let's refresh the console again and check tail and di is deleted yes the bucket is successfully deleted now let's check whether the bucket exists or not using ts3 bucket exist component credentials has to be provided Let's check ETL AWS. Running the job. job is successful but there are no any messages we have to use tjava component to print the message in the console Let's use inbuilt method. Running the job again. Yes, now there is a message true since the bucket is available. So let's provide a name which is not present in S3. We have already deleted talent DI. It is not available in S3 bucket right now. false is printed since there is no bucket called tail and di now let's list all the buckets available in s3 we have to use t bucket list component let me provide the credentials
let's use the Java component to print on the tail end console. We can use the bucket list inbuilt method. Two buckets were printed on the console. These buckets are available in AWS and they are printed successfully. Thank you guys. Please subscribe to the channel and comment in case of any queries.